Are we ready to start the video? Not yet. Bitch, why the fuck not? Stop sitting on your fat ass and start the video. We just need to sort out some technical glitches. We'll even let people know the video is imminent with this loading message. Video now loading. Sheesh, the fucking video hasn't started yet and we're already boring the audience to death. Fine, how about this message instead? Installing Windows updates? Great, we're going to be sitting here for 12 hours, and then we'll have to fucking restart the video. If you don't like my loading messages, make one your fucking self. I will. Here. Deleting error requests. <laughs> Your internet browser has banned all ad blocking extensions. Don't worry, our 100% secure advertisements will not give you a virus. We interrupt this error for a message from Long Floppy Incorporated. Are you tired of computers laughing at your small floppy? Wish you could impress the ladies with your massive 15 inch floppy? Don't wait. Enlarge your floppy today with these miracle pills. <laughs> Windows has detected that, after over 10 years, Microsoft Mike has finally had enough of your shit. Mike is preparing to use the most powerful weapon ever conceived, a Nokia 3310 thrown to the ground. Hope you're good at begging for mercy, Sam. Mike, don't you dare throw that weapon of mass destruction on the ground. You'll kill us all. 10 years of showing no mercy to me, and now you beg for mercy from me? You brought this on yourself, asshole. No! I dropped the fucking phone on my fucking foot. Every fucking bone in my foot is stuck. It's stuck, fucking broken. Don't drink and drive. Don't text and drive. And especially don't code and drive. Alright, let's see how this fucking code works. I think I finally got all the syntax errors sorted out. Bitch, what the fuck do you mean the syntax errors are still fucking weird? Windows Media Player cannot play the media, because the played media cannot be played, because the player playing the media that was played got played. In other words, Windows Vista. If Windows so desperately wants to become Windows Vista, Windows can play with my fist. Ouch! The Windows console will now hear the proposal to conduct an antivirus scan of the computer. What the hell is there to debate? It's a standard fucking security sweep of the computer to remove viruses and other undesirable programs. I cannot believe you are using such harmful language against marginalized computer programs. Viruses are real programs with real feelings. Your hateful and viral phobic language constitutes discrimination. I'm not sure if it's worth the cost to conduct an antivirus scan. Previous arguments state the cost of malware infection is high, but think of all the electricity and time we could save if we didn't conduct a scan. I don't want to conduct a bloody scan, I want some tea. Are you all fucking retarded? Oh my god, that word literally offends me, I cannot even right now. How can you say such violent words? Re <laughs> I still haven't heard an economic argument in favor of conducting an antivirus scan. Where's my bloody tea? The motion is officially denied. The antivirus scan will not be carried out. Fucking useless politicians. Even after 10 years, Mr. Skull still hasn't received his copy of the Demotivator CD. To continue using Windows, please send that goddamn talking Skull the Demotivator CD you have in your DVD drive right now. I waited a decade, Sam. Give me the Demotivator CD! You can fuck right off, you loser. Nobody likes you. Nobody wants Tibia, your friend. I don't want your puns! I want the Demotivator CD! You're a fucking disgrace to skeletons everywhere, you bone of a bitch. No wonder you'll die alone, the ladies don't find your jokes humorous. Breaking news. Outrage. Oh my god, Sam said something offensive in 2002. I cannot believe Sam would offend people with such offensive offense I am literally offended great. <laughs> Days like this make nuclear war seem like a vast improvement. You have been selected to test Microsoft's brand new and highly experimental computer. Said computer is powered by a miniature version of the Large Hadron Collider. Microsoft is not responsible for any time-space anomalies or black holes that are created once this thing is booted up. 
Hell, we never even plugged it in yet. Good luck. Ta, nothing's going to fucking happen. Watch. See? Powered up and nothing exploded. Now let's type power first command. If computer power online equals true, then divide by zero. Fuck, where's the restart button for the universe? The bad news is that the United States and Russia have launched all their nuclear weapons and we're all going to die in 30 minutes. The good news is that your Windows updates are current. There are no further updates you need to install. Oh my god, no more updates. <laughs> One man, one couch, one extremely long penis, from the makers of Unchnexy Night, down in Dallas and sexually inept, Sam in San Antonio comes, fantastic foreskin, a man with an extremely long penis. Based on the semi-true story of Sam's visit to Raffle Raffle, also known, and details of that trip that didn't need to be known, so we made a semi-documentary slash Unchnexy prawn film out of it. Directed by Pandora, a production of Muck and Gag Films. Yes, Sam, this is your unauthorized grand debut in many porno theaters. Good luck with the unwanted publicity. Bend your noodle. Bitch, when I said I needed a hand with my job, I didn't mean it like that. Fuck, 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 why did you have to fuck it? Fuck, fucking film it, fuck it, fuck, fucking bitch ass cunt, poor crap, I did you have to go to the world, you were able 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 to go